Today we've seen the result of many months of work by teams, international teams, that are working on solutions to the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. The future of humanity is going to be built by entrepreneurs. It's really remarkable to see young people think about ways to make the world better, turn those into businesses, and then come here, in many cases from far, far away, and pitch them uh, to strangers hoping to win. It was just beautiful. I'm very, very thankful for, for the M School. It feels that being a finalist, it's like winning. It's the unique experience from being here in, in four years from now. I don't know, I, I don't believe it. I don't believe that we win. It's amazing. If you're near to the problem, you can see things that people from Silicon Valley won't see it. So it's, uh, and you can do something about it. Education is fundamental nowadays if we want to make a change. So it's incredible how MS School is doing this. So I encourage to all the students from universities around the world to participate in this type of contest because it's a really great experience. Don't fear like to, to, to be there and show up. I mean, just follow your curiosity, your passion and, and go. I would encourage students to participate in the next edition of the SDG Challenge because they can, with their work and with their effort, they can come to a huge event like four years from now. They can pitch their projects to investors. They can pitch their projects to professionals. They can get huge feedback and they can basically do a lot of networking and participate in this, uh, in this huge event that is entrepreneurship and it really empowers them to succeed and to become the entrepreneurs of the future.